everybody, this is Spartanato and welcome to another episode of The Walking Dead Road to Survival. As you can see in the title, today I'm going to open a 30 day pass bonus reward and I'm going to talk about level up tournament. So without further ado, let's go straight into this box. Now, before I open the box, I want to show you guys what can be inside of this box. Now, I know that most of you guys are aware, but here's what the reward is. So once you buy your first battle pass, you will get a four star Carl which is a blue tune and he's badass. Honestly, all those people spamming him in the beginning of the game, they were so overpowered. But then everybody got epics and nobody seems to care about Carl anymore. Now, this is what you get after you buy your second and every other battle pass. After 30 days, you get this. Now, there's some badass tunes inside, like that camouflage Michonne. To be honest, she is so overpowered and I would fucking kill to get her. Then there's also this Jesus, who is, in my opinion, shit as fuck. Look at that, look at that AR, guys. 10 out of 10 and he's 106 really scopely really like that slow then this governor who's also that slow then check this guy he's a drop i got him already don't care i'm gonna get probably dwight because i'll rate three of them um i love an abraham i still have zero of them i only get one jesus so far i got maggie several times benedict and aiden to be honest except michonne and maybe that abraham i'm not sure that i would like anybody anything else and so without further ado guys let's go straight into the opening here we go are you guys ready here we go here we go and it's a Benedict. and as i expected i'm gonna get shitty but you know benedict is good since the level up tournament is going on right now I might use him to get one of my characters a level up just kidding i'm gonna save him for faction level up because this is shit so currently i want you guys to see what's going on these rewards right here the first one is glenn who is also a very very badass leader guys he's a great range leader giving all the range teammates 30 percent attack very large bonus to ap on top of that he's 45 ar which is super fast he's got 800 attack 800 defense 11k hp which is amazing he deals 300 percent damage minus 35 percent defense for three turns guys to up the three enemies and on top of that he heals three teammates so this guy is everything he's a battle medic he's so much better than zachary except zachary has neutralized but you know it's nothing to compare this glenn is something that you must have if you guys have any chances of shooting for the first place i suggest you go for him because he's such a great tune guys and you get this box as well the glenn and you get four of these so there's a chance to get those plaques and everything else second prize is eugene no turning back in my opinion he's one of the best supporting tunes in the game right now he's got an execute which helped me reach you know top top spot and he's 56 ar which is pretty fast he deals 450 damage to one enemy and cures all your teammates. No debuffs are going to work against this Eugene, guys. Bleeding, stun, tagged out, defense down, anything. This guy will cure it because he's a fucking Eugene guy. The third place to seventh place is this Lori. Now, Lori, in my opinion, is... Eh, she's got what? Lifesteal, 760 attack, 800 defense, 1100 HP, 58 um 56 is okay acceptable everything above that is just mm, meh. 350 damage and minus 50 defense for three turns to up to three enemies personally i'd never use her on my attack team yes with a command she can go second turn who really needs this she needs a command she needs andrea's lead or romanov or just that glenn and she needs one of those military rifles or any rifle with an ap bonus to pop on the second turn with command so i don't know guys if you already have those on your team you don't need this fucking housewife to pop on the second turn because you have andrea and then after that is going to be five thousand four star tokens one thousand five hundred and so on and so on and personally i cannot i mean i'm not gonna put all my resources for that lorry if she was a red lorry or yellow lorry which i already have i'd probably go for it but since she's a blue lorry i don't need her so i'm not going to put my resources I literally just did some casual level ups and I'm casually sitting on 10 to 20th slot right now. I'm 12. So all good. All Gucci. War is coming. Prepare for war, guys, because it's it's just around the corner, guys. And before we end this video, I'm going to show you the new promo. It's Shiva. Shiva is badass, guys. She is super strong, super agile. She's great defense leader, great attack leader. Everything you want is a Shiva. You know, Shiva is like pretty much everything you need. She's 45 AR, she deals 700% damage. So she's something like Andrea, except Andrea is 800. But check this out. She gets 30 defense and regains up to 30% of her max HP for two turns. So she's healing up, guys. Okay, on top of that, she's got a unique weapon. Bonus defense, 35 when taking damage. So you don't need to work on that defense. You just, you know, put some attack, put some good defense, and she's good to go. And another promo is also 
Shiva, but this one deals 800% damage to one enemy on 45 AR. Now that's a freaking green Andrea if you ask me guys. 875 attack, 770 defense, and 1000 HP is what makes the Shiva freaking amazing. On top of that, she's got collateral, so she, she, when she deals critical, she's going to splash adjacent enemies with 50% attack, and that's just incredible. And look at that, 30% attack. 30% defense, there's no need to level them up anymore. You just put one of those brutal attacks on the third slot, or you can just put that higher bonus to AP if you want, and then you can just spend two slots on upgrading that brutal attack. You can get it up to 40, she's gonna be 40 attack, 30 defense, and a very large bonus to AP, or bonus 30 attack when attacking. So anyway, or you can get stun when attacking. So this Shiva has unlimited opportunities, guys. I'd definitely pull for these if I were you guys. If I had enough money to invest in the game, I'd definitely pull. And let me know, guys. Let me know in the comments what you think about this Shiva. And yeah, that's it, guys. Thank you for watching this video. If you want to see more of these videos, leave a thumbs up. Leave a comment down below if you're going to pull for Shiva or did you get her or not. How many pulls did it get you? Click here on the left to check out my other videos. Or click here on the right to check my videos from the, of the Walking Dead playlist. Of course, you can always click in the middle to subscribe to my channel. Thank you guys for watching. This was Spartanato, and I'll be seeing you tomorrow in another video. Prepare for war again, guys, because it's less than two days ahead. And who knows? We will have new, unique epics as a reward. See you guys around. Spartan out.